of something definitely not killed by a snake. It's quite interesting. What do you think this is? I think this is a wildebeest. You see how the horns come straight out the side like that? It's got a fairly flat head. Oh, and you can see all the different bones of the skull. I think that's really fascinating. I'm still trying to learn the different bones. That one, as far as I know, is the lacrimal bone under the tear duct. This will be the frontal bone. There will be a maxilla bone somewhere around there. The orbital, what is that called? The orbital condyle. No, it's not a condyle. It's called the zygomatic arch. But the other thing that's interesting here, I think, is the fact that we think of wildebeest as being particularly dim-witted. The brain is at least the size of a buffalo's, if not bigger. So although wildebeest look gormless, you know you've met many people in the world who look profoundly gormless, but are in fact highly intelligent. I think the wildebeest is cleverer than we give it credit for. Marvellous. That's all I have to tell you about that.